I wanted to draw pictures all my life, and I found an outlet to spray, spray paint. I just started spraying. Before you know it, it took off. The whole city was spraying. Started this fucking movement. Who would believe that it turned into what it has turned into today? This is the most wildest thing in the world. That all cultures in the world came together on this. The best thing about like being like an Irish writer is I'm a battling motherfucker. I love to fucking fight. And the, the shit was years ago, there was not, not many white, white writers, absolutely none. And I love to fight. Fighting, stealing, and fucking graffiti was my living. If I fucking, I would tell you, you wanna fight? Because if they attack me or something, they wanna rob my pants, I said, you wanna fight me? And if they have, I would look at them and go, you gotta count to three before you, otherwise there's a fight. And the count to three, you better say no. One, two, and two, I already knock on them out. I love it. Because you have to go to three, it's already fucked up. But shit like that would have fights in the yard. They would always be testing you. So it was wild. And that shit turned me on. The fight, the fight was fun. And you feel good after a good fist fight. It's an old, it's an old thing. We're, that's the roots. You know about that shit? I was just tagging your name. We just tagged. Doing a little, try, trying to practice, doing a little thing. The New York City subways, that was the shit, man. It was the best. And they kept changing the colors on us. It went from a red train, then they tried different style trains on us. You know what made us? I'll tell you the truth, they said that you can't paint the new trains. It's bullshit. You gotta be a real writer. We had so many real fucking writers, there's no way they could have stopped it. They had to run some trains. If everything's painted, they have to have trains on the tracks. So that's how graffiti stayed alive. If you ain't got a lot of writers, they're gonna buff the ones that ain't on them, and then they could run the ones that they have. You have to have more riders than there is running trains. That's all. If you have one more motherfucking rider than they have trains, it's got to run. The galleries are assholes. I hate them motherfuckers. They're like a plastic imitation, thieving fucking guys that can't draw, and they tell you what they think art is. How the fuck are you going to tell me what I'm doing is this? Oh, oh, you're drawing like this. No, motherfucker, I'm spray paint my fucking name, and this is what it is. I could tell them what it is. I hate when they tell me what it is. How the hell can they tell me unless they was on the train tracks? This is the first time in all form that you could be killed. I was on the train tracks. My friend was the first rider to die ever. He fell off the back of a train, broke his neck. Night, April 12, 1973, he died. And I thought I'd see him the next day. He's dead forever. He was only 11. There's no other fucking art form that you drop, you get killed at 11. Name one. This is an art form that we're, we are fighting those trains up there, those are tons and tons and 600 volts of electricity. And we're spraying on these motherfuckers while they're still actively moving. Usually the writer, a writer's bench is a place where you have to change over from one train to another train and that was a major spot. This is Dead Lake 167, an old family, one of the original artists from back in the day. And they bring the, the music culture that I grew up, I grew up with, which is called hip hop by some other guy, Clown, or Uniform made it, that name. I mean, we had other names for everything, you know what I mean? And Wild Style's not a lettering, it's a, a way of life, and I invented it. The lettering they're talking about is mechanical lettering, like interlocking letters, which most of the people I hung out with did, so they thought that Wild Style was what it was. No, it's just the, the way of life that we live, like wild, with style. It was like untamed, but I had class. Wild Style, that's, how, that's what it means. Right now, I'm talking too much shit. I should be painting. I play Wallace, Wallace. Come on, even when you go home, your family got to kick their ass to say how much they love you. They go, where were you, you piece of shit motherfucker? I'm home! Fight! Family fight, family. Not like fighting your brother over the last egg in the refrigerator. Nobody eat that motherfucker for 30 years, but as soon as somebody cooks that motherfucker, half, where's my half? What do you mean your half? Where's your fucking half? We're fist fighting, kill each other. The egg would just sit there on the table. Fuck the egg, it was a good fight. There wasn't enough food on there, the egg to feed anybody anyway. The fight made you not hungry, it was good. The egg could stay there. It was an excuse to have a good fist fight.